it is general reading this may or may not resonate okay if it doesn't check out your other placements if you need a personal reading all that information is going to be below this person out here okay now like i said switch the sides all right now this person that you're dealing with right this person wants to come towards you okay with an apology they want to open up emotionally you're on the other hand in two minds about what you want to do with this connection either you want to walk away or do you want to still stay okay that's what's going on what's the current situation current situation you're still dangling you know so i feel this person could have communicated with you okay they could have expressed their emotions they could have apologized is also what i'm getting here okay but probably you've received that communication you're just like mm, i don't know i don't know i don't know don't ask me i don't know you know uh what's the current situation between scorpio and the person they're dealing with nice ten of swords and jerks here i have to clarify that looks like someone's reliving the memories over and over and over again or this could just be you who's just trying to get over that 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 painful break up that you had with this person where you felt backstabbed betrayed cheated we'll clarify that okay how do you view how does this person view scorpio how does this person view scorpio how does scorpio view this person oh sorry uh you view this um this person views you as someone who probably is no longer um actually what i don't sorry sorry my bad so this person views you as someone who's walked away from them okay you've just defeated you've surrendered and you're no longer wanting to uh, have a reconciliation with them they see you as someone who's just like you know what I don't want to do this anymore but now this person wants to have a compromise with you you on the other hand view this person as someone who this person probably took advantage of you there was a lack of equal give and take it was a one sided situation here okay what are the mutual energies what is the mutual energy between scorpio and the person they're dealing with what is the mutual energy between scorpio and the person they're dealing with what is the mutual energy wow scorpio so much love huh so much love so you both love each other dude two of cups here i love you you love me we are happy family kind of that you know but the two of cups here is telling me you have a very strong soulmate connection out here you both love each other you both intuitively know that you feel that but you my friend are forced to walk away from this connection because you just feel this is not emotionally satisfying you or uh, you're just lacking the stability out here okay which is why you walking away you probably were sticking to this person because this was something familiar okay you didn't want had the courage to probably walk away and go into the new or you didn't have the courage to walk away from them not knowing whether they'll come back or no but guess what the moment you walk away is when they come in and that's what happened uh what is the root of the issue what is the root of the issue of scorpio and the person they're dealing with seven of wands in reverse we'll clarify that What do you feel deep down Scorpio for this person? What do you feel deep down for this person? What does Scorpio feel deep down for this person that they are dealing with? What does Scorpio feel deep down for the person that they are dealing with? What does this person feel deep down for the person that they are dealing with? What does this person feel deep down for Scorpio? you're both in love right okay um what action will scorpio take towards this person moving forward what action will scorpio take towards this person moving forward okay what action what action will this person take towards scorpio moving forward Don't want to give them a second chance to you. What is the best possible outcome? What is the best possible outcome between Scorpio and the person they're dealing with from now until the twenty second of August, twenty twenty one? Best possible outcome. Knight of Wands wanted to come out. 
What is the best possible outcome for Scorpio and the person they're dealing with from now until the 22nd of August 2021? There is communication coming in, but for the four of souls, I feel like you're in no mood to talk to this person out here. Or probably this person is waiting for the right time to approach you because they have the ace of wands on their mind. What's the page of cups here? What's the page of cups? This person now wants to take a leap of faith with you. They want to come and express themselves emotionally. Give me one card. Give me a collective card for the two of pentacles and eight of cups. Not like we have to clarify, but still. Give me a collective card for the two of pentacles and the eight of cups. Give me a collective card for the two of pentacles and the eight of cups. You see, again, eight of cups. Dude, you're so done. Ten of swords in reverse. Why is this the mutual end? Why is the ten of swords in reverse here in the current situation? Yeah, you're moving on. That's what's happening. You're moving on, babe. You just feel, I mean, this is the worst that things could get and you'd realize that it's only up from here. Things couldn't have got worse than this. You walk away, this person comes in. Five of swords in reverse, why is that here? Five of swords in reverse. Now this person wants to commit to you with the four of wands here. But they're very scared. You probably may reject them. They feel rejected by you or they're scared of fear of rejection. They're scared of rejection, fear of rejection. Why is the six of pentacles in reverse here? You feel this person took advantage of you. And now it's left a bad taste in your mouth because although you have the best of memories with them, this person screwed up big time by making it a one-sided situation where you gave in and gave and gave and gave to a point of exhaustion and this person just didn't realize it, okay? Now this person sees you as someone they want long-term with, they want commitment with, they want to marry you, okay? Two of cups here, why is that here? <laughs> Why would the two of cups be here? Silly. Two of cups here. Because you love each other, but there is no communication between you both. Dude, you guys aren't talking. What's with you? I mean, at least let this person, I mean, know that you're no longer interested. If they communicate, that is. Or this person should, should just start to get the ball rolling, you know. Come on, open up, start talking. They won't open their mouth What's so fucking ever. There is a silence here between you both. I think you're both trying to heal and rejuvenate. You know what I'm getting? This person out here that you're dealing with, right? The love is there. They want this with you. But this person out here is trying to take things one step at a time. You know, like baby steps. Because they don't want to fuck it up this time around. Why is the seven of wands in reverse? That's the root of the issue. Why is the seven of wands in reverse? Someone needs to drop their guards, you know, and get the confidence out here is what I'm getting. They need to get the confidence out here. I think the problem here is that you're no longer fighting for this connection and you're just moving forward. That's what I'm getting. This is what's happening here. This is why all this is happening. You're no longer fighting for the connection. You feel this is just something that's slipping the ground, okay? And you can't hold on to this any longer. Whether there was competition, whether there was holding on to this person, fighting for this connection, you were doing it all by your own. You're just dropping the cards and just moving forward out here, you know? Because you no longer really give a shit to this person. King of Cups here is how they feel for you. What's the King of Cups? seven of wands babe what's the point what's the point of having your guards up and loving you oh, and loving the person here i don't know i don't care I, this is so silly king of pentacles why is that here you could be doing very well financially scorpio what's the king of pentacles here you know it's like this person out here yeah see the, you you've been hurt so bad you've been hurt so bad you can't get over that bullshit you know you're just scared that probably things will backfire here. So you're just like, you know what? I'm rather going to put in all my work and focus on something that's productive and something that gives me results and something that I can depend on rather than someone who's unreliable, whose emotions come in and out, who starts, in, you know, or with whom you have like a on and off connection with. Because again, they're coming towards you with the Ace of Wands here to start a brand new beginning. What's the Ace of Wands here? Think of Cups. Wow. <laughs> they just love you. That's it. They do. This person feels a lot for you. Judgment in reverse. Maybe you don't want to give this a second chance out here. That's your action. Why is the judgment in reverse here? Judgment in reverse. King of Swords. You're just being very logical about this. 
no longer being in your emotions you're trying to make a very head over heart decision and you're just choosing to stay very mentally balanced this person out here is staying mentally balanced but they want to um i'm not saying that this person is making a heart over head decision but i'm just saying they're trying to be very balanced out here so the love is there but you will find out that when this person even when they talk to you right it's like they'll never say i love you they'll never express the emotion emotional quotient is missing you know but the regret is deep you know the regret is deep and they want to do whatever they can to make this work out but they just want to take baby steps towards you okay they do four of swords here why is the four of swords here what's the wheel of fortune in reverse I feel this person out here is not talking to you but they still want to move ahead and move towards you with that leap of faith. They want to jump in and they want to make things work out with you. But it's just that things are just not going their favor or there are just changes coming up which they can't accept. They probably feel the timing isn't right. You know, but again ultimately this person wants to work with you. They want to build with you. They want to put in that commitment, that effort, that hard work to get the ball rolling with you. but you may feel that the situation is going nowhere which is why you probably are just choosing to just stay quiet about it you know it's like there is no uh, action from your side there's no communication from your side you're just like you know what if it's got to be it's got to be if it's meant to be it's meant to be if this person got to come in they'll come and stop me wherever i am okay but that's the truth right if a guy or girl really really wants you right they'll let you know that they want you and they will not give up okay So yeah you don't want to give this person a second chance here because you're not thinking emotionally okay and the pain the heartbreak is too much which is why you're choosing to be very stubborn very uh, conservative but i feel you're just being uh, very practical and logical okay very realistic is what i'm getting getting here this person out here now has so much love for all of a sudden that they want a leap of faith they want to start a brand new chapter with you they want to start from scratch out here okay and um The seven of wands is not always giving cards up but this is also fighting for what they want they believe they love you and they're ready to fight for this connection okay so that's what i'm getting out here whilst you out here and releasing this connection because you feel you can't hold on any longer that's what i have for you that was a beautiful reading all right so hope to see you later bye bye